I'm gonna show you how to get better head movement for the peekaboo style using a slip bag. Just like dodging real punches, using the slip bag is all about timing. If you can learn to do this, then you can learn to do this. And you should be able to learn how to do this. So when you're starting out with the slip bag, bend from the waist and take your guard with you. Don't do this. With the peekaboo style, you want to keep a tight guard at all times. And you want to move yourself in a way that makes you hard to hit, but you're always putting yourself into a punching position. Start off just slipping left, right, and down. Always returning back to the center. Once you got that timing down and it feels natural, we're gonna add in one punch and it looks like this. Slip, punch, slip, slip, punch, slip. Always returning back to the center. One thing to keep in mind is always keep your technique perfect, okay? Even if you make a mistake and the bag hits you in the face, that's okay, as long as your technique is perfect. I don't wanna see you doing these ones. Keep practicing this until you got the timing down and it feels natural. Then move on to two punches. Once you can do that, you're pretty much ready to throw multiple combinations. But there's one more move you need to practice that bridges these all together. It's what's known as the Dempsey roll. Jack Dempsey used to use this move to knock out dudes that were twice his size. Around the feather ring, now watch, watch, there, that big left, and Willard down. It's a punch you throw where you move your head from one side to the other. Not only does it keep you hard to hit by moving your head, it allows you to put all your body weight into those punches. And we're using it to connect our combinations. One final tip is practice perfectly transferring your weight with your punches. When you slip to the left, come back with the left. And when you slip to the right, come back with the right. Don't do these ones. Now that you've got all the basics done, try this combination. Jab, move your head on the cross, uppercut, Dempsey roll the hook. Then, uppercut, left hook, Dempsey roll the right. Now, put it all together. This video is just scraping the surface of how you can use the slip bag to massively improve your head movement, your technique, and even your hand speed. If you want a full breakdown of how to use the slip bag with step-by-step, -step, easy to follow instructions, I created a program called Slip Bag Mastery. There's a link in the description. Check it out, and I'll see you in there.